So in today's video, we'll be going through how to make disgusting amounts of money with AI infrastructures and selling AI systems. Now, my name is Hugo Wong. I've been doing this for over three years now, and I own an agency which sells marketing automations as well as AI automations and selling these AI infrastructures that we built to businesses which have not implemented AI yet. Now, in today's video, we'll be going through step by step how to implement this, the three step process and how we actually sell infrastructures. So just for quick proof here, let's head over to my business bank account here. Now, for some proof, I'm just gonna change the date up a little bit from 2022 to now. And you guys can see in real time um, that this isn't a screenshot. We click on apply and it's $3.52 million that we've generated in the last three years. Now, in order to do this for yourself, you do not need to have extensive tech background. You do not need a college degree. Now let's dive into how you can do this for yourself and how you can actually sign your first AI infrastructure client in less than 30 days. A few years ago, I was actually a construction worker working in Hong Kong. I was getting paid $300 a month, shoveling cement and making concrete at a construction site. I was working super hard back then, but I was only making $300 a month. Even if you're the hardest worker in the room, you still won't be making as much money uh, or you won't be making fuck you money. It doesn't really matter how hard working you are or how smart you are. The more important thing is in which vehicle are you in, right? You could be the best Olympic rower uh, going really fast on a boat uh, with raw strength, but you, you will never beat you know, some retard on a jet ski. So the point that I'm trying to make here is you wanna pick the right vehicle or you wanna be riding the correct trend, right? You don't wanna be working too hard. You, you don't need to be working too smart. All you have to do is pick the right vehicle. So let's take a look at the PC trend, for example, the dot-com boom. Steve Jobs, Bill Gates, you know, those guys are the guys who took over and capitalized on the dot-com boom, you know, making smartphones, making computers. Now we move on to the internet trend, right? Mark Zuckerberg, he capitalized on Facebook, Jeff Bezos on Amazon, and even this guy right here, I forgot what his name was, but he was one of the first guys who made a website uh, during the internet boom, and he actually made a website which looked exactly like this, and he actually sold spaces on that website for internet companies or just for regular companies to host and run ads on. And he went on to do over seven figures and sold this website for over millions of dollars, right? So it's not really how hard you work or how smart you are. It's just how able you are to capitalize on the trend, right? So let's take a look at the crypto trend, right? This guy right here, I'm sure he's a billionaire now, um, but he, he was one of the first guys who were convincing everyone to buy the Bitcoin. And even this guy right here, he's the creator of Ethereum. Now they're both balling. Again, this goes to show that it's not really how smart you are. It's really just capitalizing on the trend. Now we move on to the AI trend now. ChatGPT, DeepSea, Claude, Gemini. These are the trendy softwares and AI apps that everyone is using now. Um, but it's not really how much you use AI. It's what you build with them that matters in 2025. You know, every single one, even your grandma might be using ChatGPT to come up with a food plan or to write them an email for work, but no one's really capitalizing on using these tools to build systems which you're then able to sell to businesses. Now, back in 2017, back in 2015, you would probably need to hire a developer, hire a team, and wait months and even years to create something that's worth selling. But now with the help of these tools, you're able to build systems and infrastructures that you're able to sell to businesses in a matter of days and even weeks. And the creation of these tools alone is allowing everyday people just like you and me to build profitable AI systems that we're able to sell to businesses for over five to $10,000 every single month. And not to mention, you can also charge these businesses for a maintenance fee. So let's say you sell uh, a $5,000 AI infrastructure package to a local restaurant and that restaurant owner wants you to run and maintain that AI infrastructure. You can then charge that restaurant owner $500 every single month to maintain and make sure no bugs come up. So essentially you're future proofing yourself uh, from getting fired, from letting AI take your job, but rather you're actually staying on top of the trend and you're actively replacing other people's jobs because you're the one who's using AI effectively, which is building systems rather than just using these AI tools casually. Now, you do not need to be an expert to make money with AI or building AI systems because these tools can build those systems for you, right? So all you're actually doing is identifying the trend, which is the AI boom, right? And you're using these tools to build systems, with, right? So where do we find money? Where is money? You generate money and you make money when you solve problems for other people, right? People want you at a job because you solve a certain problem. So you're essentially just solving problems for businesses uh, who can pay, right? But who has the most money? right? And who has the problems and who has the problems that are worth solving? Well, businesses can pay, right? Well, what type of businesses can pay us? Well, the first type of business is online business, 
Well, you've probably seen ads yourself. You've probably been pitched yourself. Um, but lots of people are actually in the online space. So it's actually kind of like fishing in the pond with a hundred other people. We're all going for the same fish. Kind of difficult to actually catch your own fish because everybody else is trying to do the same thing. Now let's take a look at large enterprise companies. Now we know that a lot of people are also trying to reach out to these businesses, trying to sign them because they have the money. They have the big bucks. So it's kind of also like fishing in the same pond. So let's take a look at service-based businesses. Well, service-based businesses are a little behind because a lot of times they tend to be a little on the older side. Uh, so they're not really familiar with the recent tech and AI upgrades and updates, right? This is the type of business that everyone in my mastermind is going for and they're seeing great results. A lot of these businesses are very behind in tech and they probably have heard of AI before and they probably think that they need to use AI but they don't know how to implement it or they just don't have the time to do it. So this is a great place to start when you're trying to first pitch your AI services because these are local businesses you can reach out to instantly in your local area. And then once you've actually signed them, delivered a great result for them, then you can use that business as a testimonial to then go on to sign these large enterprise companies or online businesses. Now you might be asking me, hey Hugo, what type of service-based businesses should I go for? Uh, well, let's take a look at that, right? Roofers, HVAC, gardening, even construction, those are great niches um, to go for in the home service space. You could also go for professional service, just like accounting, lawyers, uh, real estate agents, real estate brokers, mortgage brokers. These are all great niches to go for. In just a minute, I'll be showing you how to sign these clients, different outreach strategies to sign your first client in a matter of 30 days. So make sure you stay until the end to know how to sign these clients. We'll also be showing you a few examples. Now that we've gone through the niches that you should be targeting in order to find your first client in the first 30 days of reaching out and selling AI infrastructure, We'll be going through the different types of problems that these businesses have so then you're able to come into their business, solve those problems, so then you then get cashed out and get paid for solving those problems with them by selling AI services, right? So the first thing that they experience or every single business experiences is getting leads, right? Every single business needs to get leads. So how do we actually solve this for them? In a minute, I'll be going through a few examples of a few ads that you'll be able to run for these businesses in order to get them leads, right? So in order to get them leads, we'll be essentially running ads for them on Facebook or Instagram, right? That's the first thing. And that's the first step of our offer. We're gonna be selling them ads, right? The second step of our offer is booking those appointments, right? Turning those leads into qualified leads because leads are different from qualified leads, right? Qualified leads are much higher intent, more likely to buy. And in order to qualify them, we need to use an AI dialer, right? We're gonna be building an AI agent, right? Or an AI dialer, which calls them up on the phone, says, hey, John, thanks for coming into our business. Would you like to book an appointment with us tomorrow at 3.30 p.m. so that we can come into your house and actually fix your HVAC, right? Pretty much getting that lead and booking them into an appointment so then that business is able to actually get paid from that customer. So rather than using a human dialer, they essentially are flawed because they work nine to five, right? They don't work in the overtime. They take breaks, they need to be trained, and they also cost a lot of money and benefits, right? Which business owners probably don't wanna pay versus an AI dialer, which you'll be building for them, which is able to take calls 24 seven. They're trained on a million points of data and it costs way less, right? So essentially what you'll be doing is the first step, you're gonna be running an ad for the business and secondly, you're gonna be qualifying those leads by building them an AI agent, AI dialer. The third step then speaks for itself. The business then needs to close that client and get paid, right? But essentially what we're offering isn't the closing deals because that's for the business to do, right? We've already completed our job. All we're gonna be doing is running them ads on Instagram and Facebook. And secondly is building them an AI dialer so then it's able to qualify those leads. So you've solved two out of three of the problems for the business. Now all they need to do is close a deal, right? That's a super amazing offer. And what's the best part about this? Well, it's a blue ocean, right? Not many people are doing this. Not many people are helping businesses get leads and then qualifying them with an AI dialer. You don't have to even do the work yourself. You can outsource the ads to a third party agency to do that for you. And the second part is you're essentially just building the AI dialer and selling it to that business for let's say $5,000 a month, $10,000 a month, right? So the client essentially pays you a large sum of money and you pay a small amount of that money to a contractor or a freelancer who is then gonna fulfill that service for you. So essentially you're just a middleman taking the money and taking the profits. So let's say you charge a 10K setup fee for three months support and then $500 to a 1.5K retainer and you're paying the freelancer, let's say one to 2K um, to set that up for you. So how do we actually find these clients? So then there are one of two ways to get clients. 
First way is the free way, and the second way is by running a Facebook ad, uh, paying money out of our own pocket to actually get those leads ourselves and get those clients ourselves. So then we're able to sign them uh, on a 5K, 10K a setup fee plus a retainer, right? So let's say an ad here, for example, these are all ads made by AI. So we don't actually have to hire a designer on Canva or Photoshop, let's say. Um, these are ads that made entirely with AI, so you don't have to do the work yourself. Uh, this is an ad made for the landscaping niche, so we're looking to sign landscaping clients. And this is essentially what it's going to look like on Facebook. So we go over to Facebook here. There are different types of ads that they show. So this is an ad right here. Qualifying and booking your leads, you need to understand this. If you're a business owner that is still answering your phone calls, qualifying and booking your leads, you need to understand this one thing. AI agents can do it for you and maybe even do it better. Check these out. Hey, you have reached Sweet and Clean, the top-rated cleaning service in Denver, Colorado. My name is Luna. Who am I speaking with today? So Andrew here is selling an AI agent to these businesses, which qualifies their leads on autopilot. And if you want to make video ads like this to post on Facebook, you guys can use Creativi, which is an AI tool, uh, which you just create an AI avatar. So you don't have to film the ad yourself because these AI avatars are going to be able to speak for you. And all you have to do is paste in a script, right? Say, hey, business owner, do you need... Um, 15 to 30 qualified appointments this month, right? So all you have to do is literally just go into ChatGPT and ask him, hey, write me an ad script uh, selling to landscaping niches and landscaping businesses, um, asking them if they need 15 to 30 qualified appointments per month, right? Because a qualified appointment is more important and more valuable and worth more than just a regular lead, all right? So we're gonna be using Creatify to create us uh, an AI avatar. And it's able to actually just spit out that script and read that script for us. So we're just going to wait for it just, just a couple seconds and we're just going to play it here. Hey, business owner, do you need 15, 30 qualified appointments this month? So it's just a short demo here, but essentially all in all, you're able to create an ad for you without having to be on the screen yourself, which is super powerful, right? So now let's move on to the free method, which is YouTube content. Well, all you have to do, uh, well, most of the people in our mastermind are posting videos just like these, right? They're saying automate anything, or I built an AI agent that automates Upwork. Uh, or how I bit an AI agent to automate my emails. And business owners who are then gonna watch these videos, they're gonna go ahead and book a call with you. Likely, they're gonna be asking you to help them implement something or implement an AI infrastructure uh, in exchange for money, right? So that's gonna be how you're gonna get clients. You're essentially just gonna be making ads with AI and making video ads with AI. Now, you might be thinking, hey, what does the ad lead them to, right? So after they've clicked on the Facebook ad, let's say they click on this ad here, uh, where are you leading them to? Well, you're leading them to essentially a page, right? Uh, a funnel. Well, everyone in the mastermind has access to this template. So rather than having to build a website from scratch, you're able to just use this template. Um, but pretty much this will apply to any niche. All you have to do is change it up, right? Get 24 new customers where there are 24 seven AI dialers or you don't pay, right? The landscaping client is going to see this ad on Facebook. They're going to click that and they're going to be headed over to this page here. They're going to start to look at your website and then they're going to book a call here enter their name, enter their phone, enter their email, and then they're able to book a call with you. So then you're able to sign them as a client to help them implement this 24 seven AI dialer for them. And on top of that, you're gonna be also running their Facebook ads to solve step one and step two out of the three problems of their business, which is super valuable. And more importantly, what you wanna do is you wanna phrase this call as an implementation call uh, because most people, most businesses would want to have something implemented on the first call. So you actually kind of just phrase it as an implementation call to get them on a call with you. So then you're able to sign them on the sales call uh, for let's say $10,000 setup fee plus $500 or 1.5K every single month as a retainer. Now I'll be going through some automations and notifications that we'll be setting up ourselves in order to get that client or roofing client to actually hop on the call with us to remind them that, hey, we have a call booked in on Thursday, make sure you show up, right? So this is an automation here, which every single person in our mastermind has access to, copy and paste. Um, so this is pretty much the first email uh, after they've actually booked an appointment uh, through this page here. Um, so the so email says, hey, thank you for your interest in our AI powered calling system. Uh, I noticed you explored our solution, but haven't scheduled your demo yet. Um, you know, local businesses have these problems. And if you have the time, click here to book the link. We also have email two, email three. So we actually have email automations and reminders set up to actually get these businesses to actually hop on a call with us. So then we're able to sign them for a $10,000 setup fee. If they don't want the $10,000 setup fee, you can split that up. Let's say 6K for two months, 6K first, and then 6K after we've built it for you. These are different pricing options and strategies you guys can use to pretty much sign these 
these clients and make fuck you money with AI infrastructures. So if you want us to help you start an AI infrastructure business or an AI agency, we actually have four spots left in our mastermind this week. So if you want us to help you build and scale an AI infrastructure business in 2025, so you can go on to sell these services for 5k, 10k every single month, then make sure you click on the one and only link down below uh, to book a call with our team to see if you're a great fit. If you're not, that's super cool. We don't take everyone who just comes in. We're actually giving you the systems. We're giving you all our data and our copy and paste structures. So then you're able to go on and just copy and paste and sell that to businesses online. So if you're interested in that, make sure you click on the link down below to book a call with my team and I, and we'll be super excited to help you out and build your business in 2025.